Hello, my friend. I'm uh, broadcasting this again from Maryland uh, from the estate sale of my dear mother who has passed. Uh, I want to share with you a Bible quote that literally changed my life, and, and I rely on it often. I'm relying on it now in making decisions on what to do. In 1 Corinthians 2.16, it says, We have the mind of Christ. Thank God. Thank God that I do not just have Chris Chenoweth's mind to rely upon, because often I don't have a clue of how to proceed or what to do. But I can call on a higher mind, so can you. You have the mind of Christ. See, no matter what your occupation, no matter what your interests may be, no matter what you need to learn or to grasp, the all-knowing Christ is within you. The Christ will instruct. The Christ will inspire. The Christ will fortify you. You will be able to think clearly. You'll be able to think decisively. And also, you'll be able to let go of tension and strain. When you're just trapped in human mind, that's all there is, and it accelerates. You're able to invite new ideas, right ideas, needed ideas, to flow freely in you and easily into your mind. And you're confident and you're assured, for you know that through the power of Christ, you have the ability to concentrate on whatever is before you. And also, as I have found, the strength, uh, the incredible strength that is uh, not in you at the time uh, to, to equip you to accomplish whatever it is that you face. You rejoice knowing that nothing is too difficult for the all-knowing Christ at the center of your being. And as you complete your work, you will look back and realize, gee, there was no way I could have done that alone. You're attuned constantly to the wisdom of the Christ. The indwelling Christ is your power of comprehension. The indwelling Christ is your power of concentration. The indwelling Christ is your power of perfect expression. I wish you all good things in your life, and I pray that you discover the real power that is within you, and that is that you do have as a gift to children of God everywhere, the mind of Christ.